Hello and welcome to Peachy's Mailbox. I don't know why I started this video with a song. I apologize. I don't know what that was. Okay, so welcome to another Peachy's Mailbox. I like the name now. It's cute. Um, so due to the overwhelming response to my first video i i wasn't sure how that video was going to be received i didn't know if like i said it you know people were going to say oh look at her she's showing off people are giving her gifts but uh, you know internet hate um the overwhelming po overwhelmingly positive response you guys gave me both in the comments and just for from the the number of views the number of likes floored me floored me. I had no idea you guys would like it that much. And so all I can say is thank you so much to everybody who watched the first one, to everybody who's watching this one. Thank you. That I can't tell you how good that made me feel. That made me feel so good. Thank you so much. So anyway, without further ado, here's another Peachy's Mailbox because I have three packages here. Um, I have a tiny one. I almost showed you my address. Um, I have a little bit bigger one, and then I have a gigantic one over here. I don't know what this one is. Um, the other two, I, I think I might know what they are because I think there was one of them had a uh, like a packaging, like it went to the wrong box or something, and I made to figure it out and blah blah blah. So I think I know what some of these might be, but let's open up and see. Aha! Okay. So ah, this this is huge. Oh my god. Okay, so check this out. This is, um, I had just very recently put this on my wish list. This is a Legend of Zelda, like a heart necklace. I didn't expect it to come in this fancy packaging. That is big. Let's take it out. Okay, I, I was trying to get this open, like all delicately, but it's just not gonna work. So sorry, Link. We've gotta just rip you open. I apologize. I didn't want to, but. It just wasn't coming open, and I don't have much patience right now. Holy cow, both sides look like that too. This is gorgeous. Oh my god, it's so big. Here, look, look. <sighs> oh, so many, all these things, I've been getting all these nerdy necklaces and the chains are so long. It's like, what am I gonna do with that? No, I want it up here so you can actually see it. Wow, I've got heart containers for days. So this was from uh, Brian Delphin. Delphin, Brian, oh my god, thank you so much. Thank you so much. This is gorgeous. I am taking this on vacation this week. So you guys are watching this sometime. I'm on vacation, I'm camping, and I am probably wearing this because this is amazing. Holy cow, you can see this coming from a mile away. Thank you so much. It's not gonna stay up. All right, next we have this big package, which I think also, this was the one that we had some problems because um, my Amazon wish list was um, set to go to my P.O. box, which I just got, but Brian got an email saying that the package was undeliverable. I'm like, that doesn't make any sense, because if you have, I mean, I have one of those tiny little P.O. boxes, but if there's a package that's too big to fit into it, they just put like a slip in there, and then it says you have a package, and then you have to go to the counter and, you know, show them your ID and get your package. Um, but there, it just said undeliverable, and I'm like, what? That doesn't make any sense. So I went to the post office, and like, 15 minutes later, I, I gave her the tracking number, and she's like, oh yeah, there was like a new person back there who didn't know to put the slip in there, so they just marked it as undeliverable. I'm just like, oh. But now, I officially have a post office box at my local post office that says Aurora Peachy. So yeah, uh, <laughs> the reason I, I said all that was that um, that's why this surprise kind of got, uh, kind of got ruined. Um, but it is awesome nonetheless because Brian got me um, a micro- how do you- wait. Here we go. Microphone stand for my mic. I actually saw this um, at Rihanna. Rihanna has the same thing, and I said, oh, that's amazing, because what it, what it is, it's basically one of those arms that like looks like one of the arms that like on those desk lamps that like, you know, does this. <laughs> and uh, it clamps onto the side of your desk. So like right now, I just have like the little stand that my Snowball microphone came with. And I have to like always move it back and forth and like I have, it's always pulling on the cord. So this, hopefully with this, I can actually, this woman looks way too fancy and happy to be doing 
Damn, girl, that blue eyeshadow. You put on that blue eyeshadow and you head out. Anyway, um, <laughs> so hopefully this will make moving my mic around a little easier. So thank you so much. And the other thing is something else. Oh, it's the bracket. I was like, I forgot what it is. Um, it's just, it's a bracket for the top of a... That was a lot of crinkly paper. I wanted to open it and so you guys didn't have to listen to that. It's a, it's a bracket. It doesn't look very fancy, but it's a bracket for the top of my um, DSLR camera that I use sometimes. And right now I have a microphone and a light um, on top of it that I bought a while ago. And I, you can't use them both at the same time because there's only one bracket on the top of the camera. So now I can put this on the top of the camera. I can put the microphone here and the light here or vice versa. So then I can kind of have both of them. So that is awesome. Thank you so much, Brian. Oh, so cool. So good. Can't wait to use it. Now this one, I have no clue what this is. It's a gigantic box, but it's very light. I see pink things. I can see through the tape. What is going on? What is in here? I have no idea. Okay, um, what the heck is this? Oh, it ah! <laughs> Oh my god! Oh my god! Juan, did you- you just sent me something else. You sent me the su- the, the peachy, the Super Smash Brothers peachy back there. <laughs> Oh my god, Juan, thank you so much, oh my god! Okay, this is why I'm freaking out, cause like, that was all like, I mean this was awesome, the necklace was awesome, but that was like technical stuff, and then this is just like, toys, this is, oh my goodness, this is Madoka! Oh, I love her, look at this box, this is so cute, I'm gonna open it, I'm gonna open it! Always tape! Oh crap, you gotta put her together! Ah, no, Madoka, what happened to you? Oh, so we have a base that says Madoka. All right, we got some feet. Let's put the feet on the stand. Oh, she lives in a ponytail. Hold on. Oh my god, she's so cute. Oh, oh my god. Holy crap. She ah! I've never had a Madoka collectible before, you guys. There, you can see her a little better. Oh my god, she's a lot bigger than I thought she was going to be, too. She's amazing. Oh my god, she's so cute. So for those of you who have no idea who Madoka is or what it's from, it's it's from the anime uh, Madoka Magica, and um, it's something that I've never reviewed on my channel. I did a collaboration with Omar a while ago. He's a fellow Sailor Moon reactor, and um, he's been watching and reacting to Madoka. Um, I haven't been able to do that for the series because I've seen the TV series a couple times, but there's quite a few Sailor Moon reactors who have been watching it lately because it's, you know, it's Magical Girl, so it's similar to, in, to Sailor Moon in that way, yet it's kind of like the anti-dark Magical Girl series, and it's just fantastic. It's probably my second, it's in my top three favorite anime for sure. It's amazing. Um, so I highly, highly recommend and everybody go check it out. I believe it's on it's on Netflix. Um, I think it's on Crunchyroll as well. Um, so go out and find it because it's an incredible series. And oh my god, I, I never even thought of collecting something from Madoka, but ah, uh, she's adorable. I need more now. She's so cute. Oh my god. Juan, thank you so much. I love her. I'ma put her right here for the moment. She's gonna look so perfect next to all the Sailor Moon stuff. Oh my god. <laughs> and the other thing that's in the box, because that was not it was not that giant box just for her. This is why it's such a big box, you guys. I don't even know why I put this on my on my wish list, but I did. <laughs> it's Chihuahua Opoly. Oh my god. It's Monopoly with Chihuahuas! And my puppy heard me. He wants to play. Let's play. We want to play Chihuahua play. Now I have to find somebody to play with me. Maybe I'll try and find a way to somehow like play this on stream or something. Cause I don't. Otherwise, I don't know who who to play it with. I'll, I'll I'll make Mr. Peachy play it with me. It's the property trading game for people who love Chihuahuas. <gasps> Look, he's so happy. Oh my God, are the game pieces? Unique wooden playing pieces. The pieces are little balls and bones. Oh my god. 
Juan, I can't believe you sent me more, even though you just sent me the peach figure. Thank you so much. Wow, you guys, you guys. I was like kind of a little bit stressed out today from like, I, I'm trying to record a bunch of videos today um, and to try and get them out for next week while I'm on vacation so you guys will have um, stuff to watch and so I've kind of been, not stressed, but you know, I've been trying to like get everything done and work quickly and stuff and it's been a little like hectic and this was one of my last videos and to end with Madoka figures and Chihuahua games and beautiful Legend of Zelda necklaces. Like, this was pretty much, like, this was everything rolled into one, and it, oh, it's made me feel, it's made me feel a lot better. So thank you so much. Thank you, everyone, for your support. Even if you just watch the video and, and leave a nice comment, that's, that's gift enough for me. And you guys, you guys are so awesome to me. And I can't tell you how much I enjoyed reading all the comments on the last video. I'm so glad you enjoy these videos. As before, I'm gonna put my P.O. Box address um, down in the description. And I didn't even link my Amazon wishlist last time at first, but somebody, a couple people actually asked to say, well, where's your Amazon wishlist? So they, um, so, so I added it. And um, once again, please do not, do not feel like you have to send me stuff. This is only for people who who want to, because there's P I get messages from people saying, I want to, what's your P.O. box? You know, I want to send you stuff. So, you know, this is not, these videos are not any kind of please send me stuff. Please don't, um, unless you want to. Because there's people who it makes them genuinely happy. And like I've said in my last video, it's, you know, kind of the, the deciding factor for me was someone who said, you know, I, I made, um, I made something unique for you. Like I handmade something and I want to send some, send it to you. And when I told them that they couldn't, it like kind of broke my heart because they, you know, they, they made something and wanted to send it to me and they couldn't. And I felt so bad. So that's kind of why I do this and you know just and then doing it on video now as a thank you and and um, I think is is the best way that I can say thank you so thank you Brian thank you Juan and thank you everybody who's watching right now I really appreciate it you guys are awesome all right I'm gonna let you go now um, I will see you next time thank you so much bye bye is that chihuahua